Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the video. Today we're doing something a little bit different. We have 2,000 gold, a little over 2,000 gold here. And we're going to be spending 2,000 of it on the Goblin Merchant only. So we're going to jump right into it and see what we can get from this guy. So starting off here, uh, I'm basically only going to be going for like fighter stuff for my friend Augie-san and barbarian stuff for my friend Nightshine, as well as cleric shit for me. So I'm only going to be going for that kind of stuff, rolling that kind of stuff. So I'm going to have to wait for refreshes and things, but we're going to get straight into it. We always are going to buy rings and pendants though. So 100 gold down, we have our first ring. And it is two agility, three max level, one magical power. That is not a bad ring. That's a that's a good start. That's a really good start, actually. Um, I want this fine curious for my friend Augie, so we're gonna see. And yeah, that's what we expected. That's what we expect. We expect more of the uh whites and grays and stuff here. For sure. Um Regal Gameson can be good. Round shield. I don't think we're going to get any of this stuff. This really isn't good for us because Augustin only uses long swords. And as a cleric, I only use heavy armor and heater shields. And my friend Bar Barbarian Man doesn't use any of this. So we're going to wait on the next refresh and we'll get right into that now. The All right. I'm going to buy him a. I'm buying Nightshine and full tunic and a helmet because this is the only good shit in this shop. I'm not buying anything else. Get him the juice. So I'm going to buy both. I hope it's good. But you know it's the couple merchant, so you don't fucking know. Alright, we all think, we all think. Oh, it's bad. Both of them. Yeah, it's oh, bad. Right. It's bad. Right. Oh, it's bad. <laughs> oh. It's bad, dude. Classic. Oh, don't gamble. Good old goblin. But we're only um, no, we're like... We're only like... Uh, like 300 gold down, so we got like 1700 more to go. So we're gonna keep going. Alright, I'm also buying these for Nice Shine. 50 gold. Oh, Nice Shine. Uh, do, do, are you yeah. sure? What kind of gloves do you want? What kind of? Are you sure? I Those are the people? gloves. I use them every single time. All right, all right. It's gonna be what garbage. Too. He Bro, garbage. Another fifty gold down. I oh, don't even fuck. use them. is not even worth. Oh, okay. Oh, what a friend. What a friend. I don't even use them. I'm, uh -uh. I'm gonna roll the pants. Nice I'm gonna roll the armament. All right. Seventy-five and fifty. And helmet. yeah, Goblin is just so. Alan is uh he don't love you. Alright. Buying the birdies. Free night shine, the double axe for night shine, and the heater show for me. Bye. And it all looks like garbage. Great parties, let's go, dude. <laughs> oh, blue double axe? Okay. That's oh, not dude. too bad. That's okay. Good. Agility's great on Barb. Dude. And plus an additional Flat. physical. Okay. We got something good. Other than that ring at the very beginning. It's the first oh, yeah. good thing we've gotten. <laughs> And then a gray heater shield. Yeah, that's what you expect. So I've gotten two good things out of like six, seven pulls. No, fucking ten pulls. We've gotten two good things. <laughs> so the only good thing is to buy is the ox pendant and hope we get some good. Blue ox pendant. Oh, that's good. Nice shine. Two strength, yeah, one weapon damage. Buff duration bonus. All right. So we're going to buy the heater shield. And the plate pants. The ring of is not good. And the rest is just garbage, I think. And then we get a... Oh! Green heater shield plus one all. I guess they're not the worst. And then white plate match. Yeah, that sounds about right. <coughs> Alright. So this time Maybe we got a Templar armor, which we're going to buy. Because it'd be good for me or Augie. Longbow could be good for Augie. We're going to buy that. And then Ring of Quickness could be good for Augie as well. So I'm going to buy that. He doesn't care about Barbudos, so I'm going to buy that. Don't care about Marauders, Rogues, Mystic. Don't care about any of that. So the temple armor, fucking garbage as usual. Longbow garbage, and the ring of quickness. Two agility, and physical damage reduction. Ah, that's bad. Alright, this one's really good. We're gonna send four different items. We're gonna send the tunic. 75 gold. Yep. Heavy gauntlets in that. Long swords in yep. that. And then I the did. heavy gauntlets in that. I don't think there's a five-hander, quarter staff, oracle robes, or any of this is any good. But... Fuck. The Northern Full Tunic. Great. Yep. Oh, blue gauntlets. Oh, they're so bad, though. <laughs> white long sword and white leather leggings. Dude, this Goblin Merchant is just not worth, dude. Oh, it's a bummer. The purple's just non existent. Anything above blue is just non existent, apparently. Alright, this time we got Fine Curious that we're gonna buy. Longbow and heavy boots, because the rest is useless for our squad. Longbow, long 
Oh, heavy boots. This is probably gonna be garbage. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god, dude. This is gonna be <laughs> such a waste of money, just like the rest. Northern full tunic, battle axe, and heavy leather leggings. This has been his Vihander every single time, I swear. But anyway. The Northern full tunic, of course. Great. Yep. Battle axe. White. <laughs> and the... Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, I think we spent 2,000 gold by now. And all I can say is... Don't buy from the Goblin Merchant. Ever. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> this time around we got Necklace of Peace. We're gonna buy that. Thunning Axe for Nightshine. Warm off for Nightshine. Oh, I don't Woo! even want to look at it. We've had such bad rolls, dude. I just want one go good roll. One good roll, dude. Uh, blue Necklace yeah, of Peace. I, I never... You can't trust the Goblin. It's That's always blue say. on the necklace. I think the necklaces and rings are always worth. But... Necklace piece, two knowledge, one resourcefulness, two weapon damage. They're guaranteed greens. Not the time to bad, but so. good for me. Yeah, guaranteed greens. So necklaces and rings are always worth. But felling axe, right? I know it's gonna be bad. Oh, green, warmall, green, gray. green warmall. Oh, gray warmall, green felling axe. Golden merchants. Golden merchants a bitch. One crossbow, one necklace piece, and then one magic staff for fucking funsies. So I want to run a magic staff build. One crossbow, 100 gold down, necklace piece, and a magic staff. Yep. Two knowledge, one strength, physical damage reduction. It's not bad for me. And the magic staff, just what you would expect. Ring, heavy boots, ring, ring, heavy boots. <laughs> oh my god, I have no gold. Ever. And it's all gray. All right, first string, blue, of course. Two agility, automatic coat speed, projectile reduction. That's pretty bad. White boots, green ring. Oh, God. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> uh, how much are we in the hole now? Um, 26, 27, 28. I think you we're 3K in. More and more. Yo, if you've made it this far in the video, you're a legend. All right. But we haven't broke that 3,000 gold threshold just yet. We have one more item to buy. We're going to send it on this badger pendant in honor of this one right here. This pre-nerf plus three all attribute best in slot wizard pendant that I am looking to sell. But I'm not quite sure the price yet. I'm thinking two to three golden keys or something. This thing is... I don't think you get better in this for wizard. But in honor of that one... Which, this could never be as good. And to break 3,000 gold, we are going to send it on this one here. And we get... This is this is the perfect way to round out this whole gambling experience, alright? Let me just tell y'all, if, if you have bad luck, completely stay away from the Gullah Merchant, no matter what. Just, just stay away from the Gullah Merchant. Just do not do it. I've spent 3,050 gold on this guy in the past two days. And I have gotten not a single purple. Not a single one. If you have good luck, I would say go for the Goblin Merchant. But it's literally just a money sink. And it's it's not worth it. I probably am over my gambling addiction on this guy now. Like, for real, for real. I, I won't be gambling with him much at all anymore. But this was just a fun little video I wanted to try out. We were 3,000 gold in the hole. We luckily, this is a day after. And we worked our way back up a little bit. And then, of course, we have this to sell, which is amazing. If, it, if you're going to take away anything from this video... Don't buy from the Gullah Merchant. Save your money for actual sh stuff you want to buy, alright? Don't waste your money on the Gullah Merchant. Unless you have insane luck. I don't know. Go for it. But that is it for this one. We're a little disappointed in it, to say the least. I'm sorry if y'all stuck around and you're a little disappointed in it as well. I am too. At least you're not 3,000 gold in the hole. And now you know to not do the Gullah Merchant. Anyways, I hope to catch you guys in the next video. Good luck out there in the dungeons. Be safe. And peace out.